Hold up. And near that mid lane as well, while Abed is forced to orb. Oh, he's dead! First blood for Miposhka and the Diva. You couldn't ask for a better start. Oh, this is it. ridiculous! This is perfect. Uh, e XP to Yatoro, because that uh, XP is getting denied. And we can see the odds on screen. Team Spirit definitely favored in this one. Considering the start, not a surprise. Yeah, absolutely not. The bear kill, the, the obs D ward, the bounty runes, and that first blood on our bed while Fly Confirm. does die down bottom to Mira and Collapse. Set. Expecting things to go the other way with a lone druid and his Dawnbreaker who can play aggressively. On Juggernaut, so now the Monkey King. We saw one on Seth trying to get it on Io two times actually. All three heroes met. Coming straight in towards the Void Spirit. Toronto Tokyo assimilates back away. Jumps with the actual step. The shards will land, but his raindrops keep him healthy. And crit dying to the poison touch of the dazzle. So the rotation in from Eposhka more than pays for itself. He can deny the DD rune. He can TP out. Can he? Oh, you're right. He might just be able to slip away from danger. Starbreaker ah, gets in from Fly. The last moment needed. Yeah, that was the strike. The ability to clear out Eidolons, especially when he's got Jingu stacks up. Very Big useful for the monkey. The crippancy on top lane. Enigma about to hit level five. Monkey six and a half. That's, that's not what we expect, is it? With Enigma di denying all these creeps. Miposhka did a very good job zoning out Tusk. Didn't yeah. allow them to play aggressively at all, forcing Tusk to TP out. Uh, Tusk didn't have boots of speed. He played more for the lane. Uh, had that magic stick. And fairy fire. We go. Toronto, Tokyo. He wants RTZ. Mira does die to fly, but that's a whatever moment. They've killed the lone druid. Taking him out of the game while Yatro is being chased down by Crit and Nightfall. Eidolon's tag team slowing him over and over again. Battle strike comes as Yatsura tries to fight back. He, does have he might find Nightfall here with a couple more swipes over his massive stick. And they don't even get the clipping for Team Spirit. I still yet to see Arbed really make his mark on this game yet. Hasn't got a coil out, hasn't found any real openings. And missed out on Toronto Tokyo, who turns it straight back onto Arbed, kills his courier and mirrors help here. We'll find them a kill on the puck. <laughs> Team Spirit is playing so much faster and snap. They're stunned with Solar Guardian, so that's a big pickup. We're on to Tokyo. And a fine flight. Uh, they got enough damage to finish him off, because the Celestial Hammer creates a bit of a gap, needs the extra Astral Step. That's a dominating Dawnbreaker. She was 4x kill streak there. Oh, that's Infernal Blade, so good against the bear. Every time he gets tagged, he loses like It's only like level one Infernal Blade. Yeah. Radiant's middle tower. 70% of his HP just disappears. We're gonna go in with a Savage Roar. Mira, he towed the line there so he can keep the spells going and claims the 300 gold and XP again. To get something on the map, we'll snowball onto Mira. Catch the Zeus out with a quick little shard and he leaps over the igloo. Easy as can be. Now Toronto Tokyo. Hasted. Potential to wrap around into the back lines. Doom gets dodged down a little bit there by the Arbet phase shift and they black ball collapse straight off the bat. Mira can still zap back in with a lightning bolt and Miposhka. will just save his body for a second while the Wukong's battle strike. Arbet is taken out inside the circle. Now the battle from Yatro comes out. Catching out Nightfall and Toronto Tokyo. Still playing in the back lines. Enigma, what can he do? Malefici can try and run away, but they've got a Yule Scepter up into the sky. Fly and crit, they want this void sprint. No, they've got a damage. Here comes the TZ. Alundra does arrive, and Toronto Tokyo grieved up. Dissimilate in three play seconds. One charges. He's got the wand, and now Dissimilate Astro Step. The Poshka picks up the double kill. Can he get a root? I believe he can. He's way too Go speedy. On. Mask of Madness is available. Go on. There it is. I did kill off Yatsuro in the midst of all that. Oh, the bear got to be so careful. Against Collapse and the, the hurricane back into the waiting arms of Mira and Miposhka. Another bear dead. On Void Spirit, so he definitely wants to go in. Miposhka already has Shard. Yeah, the Thunder God's Wrath as well to try and scout them out. Toronto Tokyo on the Nightfall, straight towards the Enigma. Catch him out, kill him off. There's no follow up. This Three -man coil call. looks good, but uh, no one is around. Into what? Into nothing. And the Deep Ward still. Providing a ton of vision, giving them uh, that uh, vision that they need to start a fight. Athero, with this uh, build, attack. head of Midas Echo Saber, he wants to join relatively early on. Yeah, continue these fights, Radiant keep on going, brawling away. Well, they spot fly, they see Crit jump the task. Easy will fall back. 
they understand that uh, they got what they came for. They got that the tier 2 tower and uh, potentially get the outpost. Might be a bit uh, tricky standing there. Yeah, Team Spirit want to reclaim that. But EG just holding their Radiant's ground at this point. Tower is under attack. Arcane Rune spawns up at top. Front of Tokyo He's Mira. thinking about going in. Yeah, and he gets in. Try and get the bear, but the fear and the coil, the snap and the kill. The grave comes in. The Boshka saves from the Tokyo. Sibling now out as well. He's got the one charge to Yord. He's working himself out of here. Surely not. Our bet will finish you off. That was such a greedy play from Toronto. Even though they have heals coming out from Dazzle and the Shallow Grave, it's still doom. not enough. And there's the Doom. Solar Black Hole on to him. He spent his Doom. Our bet. Should be all right there with the red pack near it. I don't have too many heals to pump into the puck, but yeah, perfectly fine. To even farm away at neutral. BKB drives the Wukongs with punch down. Arbet cleared up by the Thunder God's Wrath. Finishes him off with a last grip. Destroyed by the monkey and the boundless gives him a double. Was expecting competition. Now, what a turnaround from Team Spirit. They did uh, once again heavily commit from EG to get that doom. A lone Druid in, in his ulti form, but the Spirit Bear in particular. Having a static field to be percentage effects down is massive. As Nightfall just get cleared out. They've got the coil in onto two of them, and Miposhka dying next to his Monkey King, but the Wukongs will come out. RTG Savage to roll, out. push him away. The attack of King of Claws keep him inside, but he's still going to get pummeled down by the lone Druid. EG understanding that they need to take out Dazzle first, and uh, finally they're able to... Oh, trying to get here to D-Ward, Toronto Tokyo, very aggressive with his play, he's got the Yul, saves himself, the two-man battle, and the Wukongs, in we go, Mirror dominating, and EG lose a couple of heroes off the bat, the Black Hole, here comes Nightfall, but it's cancelled by the Doom, Yatoro can keep whacking away at EG, and they've got to run, they can't keep on fighting here, Team Spirit far too strong. And they're going to catch him with the Remnant, uh, there's no way Fox is getting out of this one. Two buybacks already used on EG. It looks like a good opening because they try to fear Dazzle away and focus down on the Monkey King, but uh, not Monkey, uh, Void Spirit. And he gets the Yule Scepter off, uh, gets to dissimilate, and manages to survive there. How selfless from the Tokyo is. The Savage Roll, the Monkey King, the Black Stop, the Doom's in the same, and the punch from Crit will catch out to the punch, who grieves him, turns the punch, the Jingu stacks. Life stealing away, but it shouldn't be enough. The Bear will turn him into lunch. And collapse, entangled and roared up by RTZ. But Toronto Tokyo coming in again. You see him fall so quickly. They're still alive. The bear still going with his double damage rune until Mira cuts him in half. My boy Chris still want the dazzle. Oh, they are playing again. This final Can't kill. He jumps away from the remnant. Toronto Tokyo trying to deward now, but he's coiled up and snapped. Snowball in the punch from Crit. Trying to focus down the Void Spirit, but he's been graved and Apple stepped away. Arteezy oh, inside the Wukongs, they're fighting the bear. Good Both fear. of them, in fact, with a solid guard. There's Fly with a heal on the black hole. Okay, the no. They catch collapse. The big target they wanted, but the grave again. Saving him up. If Hodgkin doing a great job. Can't get the Doom off. They do kill Mira and collapse now. The buybacks will flow through while Crit running back, but picked up by Yatoro. And collapse has got Fly. Easy pickings on the Dawnbreaker to end the fight. No buybacks on either of those heroes. So a 5 e prize in itself. Oh, hello. Wukong's Nimbus found the strike. Lincoln's popped the hex as well. Arpet dead for 80 seconds. Now fly. He's the next one on the meal ticket for Yatoro. Big play Thinking from the Poshka, using four staff aggressively to proc that Lincolns and then getting the poison touch. And now the Yules into Remnant, catching out the Dawnbreaker, two heroes dead for over a minute. Oh, oh Lord, he's here. Oh, he's easy. alone. He's walked into disaster. They're going to finish off the bear, Doom of the hero, Toronto Tokyo, Apple Step, the Black Hole, does catch out the Doom, but Toronto Tokyo jumped away. They only find Collapse, and he's graved up. He's perfectly fine. <laughs> And he, the, like, the collapse. Maybe an opportunity, though. They see collapse. But look at that quick jump. The black hole only on the Duke. Try and focus collapse, but it's Wukong's command. They're so powerful, it's zoning EG back. The Toshka collapse. All both dive. They're going to buy back up on the Doom. And Yatro focusing in towards RTZ. The lone Druid. Battle Strike misses. Yatro will finish off. One more swipe with a bow staff. In they move towards the poor fly. Dawnbreaker now. As Team Spirit swipe down with. Sweet vengeance! Little buybacks needed to use in Team Spirit to secure this fight. In 80 seconds without Lone Druid, they do have Aegis. Not oh, it's a misclick. 
There we go. Arcane power. This is an immense claim. That's a big jump in. A black hole hits onto the Monkey King, and the Void Spirit of the Grave may be able to hit a save, but the Monkey does have the Aegis as well as backup. EG, not losing anyone just yet. Well, I'll bet Toys are the back line. Monkey King does die the first time. That's the Posca hides in the tree line. Mira zaps back in for another one, but the black hole is there again. Monkey King caught up. Grave, but he's gonna turn. The BKB won't come. He's still healing up. Taken out by Arteezy and crit low. Big, big play from Nightfall. Also, I love that he wrote misclick. I look at the screen, I'm not looking at what's happening. I'm reading the chat, suddenly he lands a perfect black hole. A little bit of a distraction there, but uh, it worked out in the end. Also, He's double bad. damage spawn bottom. Oh, the DD. Did they see it? Give it the gift to Bear. Oh, come on, EG. Fly will scout it out. Send the Bear down here. Give no one has damage buyback rune. on their side. 60 seconds until this, Monkey King. This, 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 this is game. They're just gonna go and end the game. They're gonna poke, see what happens. What do you mean poke? That's not poking. The building just cease to exist. The are destroying thinking. them so quickly. Tier 4, here we go. EG gonna they, they got the shot the game. There's nothing to stop them. Oops, oops, yeah. Go on, EG, finish it off. Team Spirit in such a dominant position. I'm just... Gotta be... You need some mangoes, you need some clarities. Oh, hello, Mira. Level 4 clockwork. Haste Rune gonna get bottled up by Arban, and this is a move into towards Toronto, Tokyo now. Fly, with the help of the coil, has the snap and the stop to chain stun the Void Spirit, and again, exceptional execution from EG. EG all over the place. Uh... In a good way. Yeah, <laughs> in a good way, exactly. Also, Phoenix, I don't think they're gonna get the value from Supernova. You have Viper, who does have a lot of attack speed. Alf Wolf gives that nice burst. Pump the damage in towards the creeps. But Chen, we get caught down here. Does and the magic God, stick as well. Magic stick, not gonna be used. Gets a stop block to the Phoenix. But no one backing up Fly. Well, up towards top, collapse. Well, can't continue diving. Crit's arrival, and Abad's jump with a coil on bat. Kiss is launched. Out come those globs of lava. Bob Not Trump's gonna land on the far away. Rider and he is speeding out the ring. Fall might be in trouble. Hook shot, finally. Yeah, and the Phoenix with a bit of damage in from the side, but they, they are struggling to break through this Nightfall Viper until the Sniper comes in with a peace peep and a kill on the Viper. Now a little Shredder, though, finishing off the deny. Yatra denies the Supernova. That's a big what play. A sick play. <laughs> that's that's a play right there. He knows that the egg's gonna die anyway. Down bottom, really wanting this tier one tower, but Alas is here to meet them. Lasso, the firefly, stacks an A-palm on the spec. He's gonna hold to jump away, very quickly disengages from the Batrider. There's Mira, a little bit caught here. Does cogs into crit, but nightfall. Radiance Launch out the poison projectiles, take him down. Collab's gonna go down as well. Viper already has his number. This Radiance is gonna be tower for our DZ. Team Spirit, they're a bit disconnected. They need it and do. I use that as an excuse all the time. Oh god, pull back. The hurricane is so stuff, but does get the supernova as that expires. The shot catching fly chain and with the angle landing. Great kisses. Oh, landing on Tamira out to Tokyo, but he'll dissimilate himself out of range from that artillery once more. Our bed with a DD rune. Still wants to get involved in Nightfall. Also making his way forward. They're pressuring past the tower so Arteezy can hit the building. Uh, ben still 10 to 15 seconds left on that double damage. Needs to start hitting the tower. Or oh, might be looking for Miposhka. Yeah, trying to, trying to poke. Not gonna, gonna share my neutral items. Up to the high ground, Abed goes. Cookie. Well, where is he? Oh, he's drawn into an orb. <laughs> Abed got lost there for a second with the cookie. He's gone to the west, Get headed off to California. They see me, Poshka, they see Mira. Slide, spotted by the creep wave. Gets the hand of God out there, but this Sunray Supernova doing some serious work. Abed hunting the sniper, focusing the key targets. Void Spirit dying to the lava launch no, now man, from the water. And can't get himself away. Sniper's still able to stand his ground and do some serious damage though, but they're cooking forward. The Centaur and Ultimate Posture and uh, EG are blowing them up. Sniper's now being tanked by the poison attack, slowed to a crawl and taken out of the game. Nightfall's going ham. 
He does not care about any of this damage right now. Way too tanky. And Arbin as well. This might be a full team wipe. It looks like it. You know, all the way. Poison attacks not going to be enough to finish off Mira. So he is safe up on. Has a Dragon Lance, so very difficult to kill. They have like one ability that goes through Magic Community. That's Flaming Lasso. Supernova as well, but we I, I don't think we're going to see the Supernova go off in the fights. Radiance bottom tower collapsed. Sold. Smoked, ready to blink in. Potentially drag someone down. Still two and a half minutes left on Aegis. Yeah, the Lord of the High Ground, the Lasso, and the Supernova there going to clear through Nightfall. Even though they're going to heal from the Chen. Crit going to jump out of the cookie away. They've slowed him with that whip though, and finding the crit snap fire. That high ground board, the difference maker. Wait around this cliff top. Coil on the Void Spirit, Sans is up the puck with his Resonant Puck. Not ideal, he doesn't even need to commit with the old center and drag back. He got it off on Nightfall, but his Supernova is going to land it on top of it. Great, all oh, it's the finish with a little shred. Out down by the Nightfall by Boy Yatro. BKD TP, oh, just about, so makes it home. So close to death, but Collapse not going to be as lucky. Nightfall with a double kill and e Sentry, but not the OBS, does it? Yeah. No, potentially Vision is here and he'll play under it. Collapse blown up and up it. The single man coil, the tin man, has no more battle plan. Mira gonna get melted. Poor little clockwork, but the Spectre being pew pewed by the sniper. And Toronto Tokyo has that defensive Yule. Yatsuro getting jumped again by Arbad and Crit. Cookie in, the sniper still able to stand his ground and fight away. Big damage from the glass cannon gets Yatsuro a double kill. Assassinate flies and Nightfall dies. Ball. This is it. This is it. This is what Team Spirit needed. They needed the prepping himself for a big supernova. Under dire vision though, Arbad and Crit lining up to look for him. Mirrors in the pit and snatches it. They and he grabbed by the, the shard. Work the shard as well. Oh, Artuzi's missed Three a trick minutes. here. Four staff out. Mira Three still going to get hounded though by like Crit and Artur. All right, Toronto, this, this so deserves cute. a clap. What a beautiful hook shot because they they were underneath the shrapnel. And all right, he's going to go for it. Yeah, snaps the call on the drop of Tokyo full screen. Pushed across into the waiting arms. But he's used up in the end. It's if like he can come out not fast enough. Right, the pulse that will save him on the high ground. Supernova here in Yatara. Letting the sniper stand as grab a fight, but Spectre's on him. The collapse will chase Arteezy. Crit will shred him back to Miposhka, but this collapse back doing a lot of damage. Finally dies. Mira does have a hook shot available, and he's gonna find an angle. Straight on in. A surprise out of this one. Fly got a double kill on his chin, but he's about to lose his own life. Mira will chase him back. Arbet kills Miposhka, and everybody's does gonna have a die. Hook Another jetpack available, but he's Oops. so slow. Rocket, Rocket in a second. And one charges. Go and do the job on him, Mira. Get the kill. Oh, no. Can't control the clockwork. <laughs> Still, we gotta give credit for that. This is a full team wipe. This is a sick EG walking in towards Radiant Vision. They do hold forward. The Hex on Sniper. They found Yatoro. He just spent all his money, hasn't he, Lacoste? He just bought everything. That's a full Silver Edge, as you said. No buyback for it. DD Rune spawned top. Roshan spawning in two minutes, but this. I think EG should have a pretty good read. That Sniper does not. Likely Nightfall with that shard and also Sight of Was does have enough uh, mana sustain. Eight poison attacks on buildings. Look at it melt. Yeah, stacking up that minus armor on it. And a hex on to the Void Spirit. Forced across the coil comes onto the two. The Eon Disc is there, but the coil snaps again as the kisses land. The drop to Tokyo. The self yours will buy a moment of safety as he jumps out of danger. But with so many casualties now, Team Spirit surely have no chance of defending their base. EG have come in to win this series, claiming a 2-0. Unless some kind of miracle happens. Oops. We we can start uh, thinking about, you know, divine rapier on Sniper, but he's sitting at uh, 200 gold. It's going to be very, very difficult to eat. The Spectre's potential to jump. Got to change the scan on Sniper, even though this one is uh, very expensive. Hey, it is, isn't it? It's like a thousand euros, something like that. Now, to Tokyo. Rocking the Eon Disc already. Very early on, so 140 seconds without it. 
And now the building's under pressure from Nightfall with the poison attacks. Does get broken by the Silver Edge. Let's we'll see if they can drag them underneath with the Aghanim Scepter on Bad Rider. They've got the stun on the Phoenix, finish him off, so no supernova. Yaptero hiding in his fountain, cowering away. The sniper is peeping towards Arteezy, but it is just not enough damage. EG will life strike Yaptero. The lasso cancelled again by the hand of God, and GG's called. EG not only claiming one victory, their first, but now.